Hey loves, what's up? It's Christina. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new, I post videos on motherhood and lifestyle. And today I'm going to be talking about my tips on how to increase my breast milk supply. I'm a breastfeeding mama and it is National Breastfeeding Week and month. And I wanted to share with you guys some tips on what I did when my breast milk was feeling low. So if you're interested in learning some of those tips, continue to watch to the end. So I know how hard breastfeeding can be. I've been nursing my baby ever since her first day of life at the hospital. And I know that my milk has fluctuated throughout my whole breastfeeding experience. So that's why I wanted to share with you guys some things that I did to increase my supply when it felt low. And I know I wanted to continue to breastfeed and not give up. So the first thing that I made sure to do to increase my breast milk supply is drink tons of water. Now I love this water bottle because it's reusable, it's dishwasher safe, there's glass on the inside and then silicone here and then also has a lock just in case you want to make sure it doesn't spill or anything. And I love it because I was able to take it anywhere. I could take it when I was strolling around the neighborhood with the baby. I could put it in my diaper bag, whatever it was. I was able to take this 12 ounce water bottle and make sure that I get water all day long because breast milk is made from water. So if you're not drinking enough water, your supply is going to drop. On top of the fact that water is just so important for our bodies in the first place to stop you from being dehydrated and to make sure that you guys are staying healthy. So the number one thing you should try if you're trying to increase your milk supply is drink more water. I know that I drank around like eight to 10 bottles of this and I know that it definitely felt like it helped my milk supply when it felt like it was well. So make sure you guys are drinking your water. So the second thing I did to help produce more breast milk is I changed my diet. I made sure that not only was I eating healthy, but I started eating more fruits, more vegetables, and I added oatmeal to my daily diet. Oatmeal is a great source of fiber. It also has whole grains, and it helps produce more breast milk. So the one that I use specifically for people that have a shop right near you is I use the Wholesome Pantry Organic Quick Oats. It's just a healthy filling meal for you and it just helped produce my milk. I made sure to add fruits and vegetables like blueberries, bananas. I even added it in my smoothies and had like oatmeal, fruit. I put either almond milk or coconut milk. Coconut milk helps produce your breast milk as well. I would add that to a smoothie alongside with some spinach or some greens. Mix that in a smoothie and have it as like a lunch or a snack or a breakfast every day. So make sure you are getting your oatmeal intake because it really does help produce more milk. So the third thing that I did to help produce more breast milk is I added in lactation tea. I know that I use specifically this brand called Pink Stork. Pink Stork Lactation Smooth Vanilla Tea. It's organic and caffeine free and it gives herbs and supports the production and flow of your breast milk. Now I would have this every single night. It's caffeine free so I would have it before bed because I know that my baby drank more overnight and I wanted to feel full. I wasn't eating overnight and I was drinking less water overnight. Having the tea before I went to sleep just helped produce my milk. This one tastes absolutely delicious, so definitely add this to your regimen if and nothing else is working, because I know it worked for me, as well as the brand um, Mother's Mother's Milk. I can't remember it right now because I don't use it as often, but I'll be sure to link it below. I used to use that type of tea as well, but I ran out. I just love the Pink Stork one. So definitely add some lactation tea if you need. So the fourth thing that I did to help produce my supply is something that is free. If you don't want to take supplements or add anything or spend money on anything, it's power pumping. Now, if you haven't heard about power pumping, it's recommended by lactation consultants and it's really easy to do. You just have to have time because it takes around like 20 to 25 minutes. But if you add it into your day, every day, it definitely could help you produce more milk. So I would take my Spectra pump and I would actually do it to both breasts. You could do it one or the other, or you can do both at the same time. And you're pretty much just pumping on a regimented schedule. So you would basically would pump for 10 minutes, take a break for five minutes, pump again for 10 minutes, take a break. So you're going on and off, on and off for a total of like 20 to 25 minutes. 
I'll be sure to link the picture up above and put it in the description on how to do it. But it is pretty easy to do and I do remember doing it. It did help my milk supply. It just takes time out of your day to do it. So you have to have some time to do it. But it's definitely something that you should try if you don't want to spend money on anything. I definitely think it works. So the fifth item that I use to be able to increase my milk supply is from this brand called Milky Mama LLC. Now I actually found out about Milky Mama through my Instagram. One of my good friends who's a breastfeeding mom as well recommended that I watch and follow Milky Mama when I was pregnant and I just fell in love with their stuff that they have. I love their Instagram because the person who created it is, is a breastfeeding lactation consultant mother as well and she's always giving lives and sharing great tips on how to be better at breastfeeding. So what I used from Milky Mama was they have a whole bunch of different items that you can um, purchase from them. But what I used, what I first got was like a sampler pack. And the sampler pack has things like lactation brownies, lactation cookies, and different types of drinks and supplements. So what I recommend using is their lactation lemonade because it just tastes so good so you basically just mix it with water you mix it with I believe 8 to 12 ounces of water and have it one or two times a day and it comes with different packets so if you add this it's like having just natural lemonade with your drink and that helps you produce milk as well as I definitely had the brownies which I love too but had to cut back on that because you know it is fattening but I also use their Milky Mama Pumping Queen, Pumping Queen, which is a dietary supplement, and you just pour little droplets into like your tea or your coffee, or you could just put it straight into your mouth, and that helps produce more milk as well. So if you start using these these type of things consistently, like maybe for like a week or two, you will definitely be able to produce more milk and help you increase your milk supply. So definitely check Milky Mama out. The sixth brand that I wanted to recommend that will help you increase your milk supply is something that I heard about online as well, and they're called Legendary. Now there's these Legendary supplements that a lot of different YouTube mamas recommend it to help your milk supply, and I know that it worked for them. I wasn't able to use it regularly because all the other things that I was doing helped me, but if you're running out of ideas, definitely check Legendary breastfeeding supplements out I'll be sure to link them below and give those a try as well because when your milk supply is down I was willing to try anything that I could and the seventh thing that I would recommend that I know I did is I made my own lactation cookies and my own lactation brownies at home I know it can get really expensive to buy different lactation supplements and foods Trust me, so I started making my own lactation cookies and brownies and I'll be sure to link the recipes down below. But if you're interested in doing that and you just don't have it in your budget to always be buying different supplements or drinking a lot of water just isn't working for you, try making your own lactation cookies or brownies below. Just using like oatmeal and coconut milk, things that you regularly will have in your house so that you can get in your supermarket for a low cost. Definitely try making those. You actually get more if you're baking them yourself at home than buying packets of cookies and brownies for lactation. So definitely give those a try and it's something that is fun to do. So those are all the things that I've used throughout the months on increasing my milk supply for feeding my daughter. I'm a breastfeeding mom for 12 months so I've definitely experienced fluctuation within my breast milk but I know that whether I was drinking a lot of water, eating healthy, or trying any of these supplements that I've mentioned before, my milk supply definitely increased. So I wanted to share that with you guys because I know breastfeeding is definitely challenging. And whether you're a breastfeeding mama or you, you wanna try to be a breastfeeding mama, just know you just even thinking about trying to give your baby milk that's produced from your body just makes you amazing in the first place. Whether breastfeeding works out for you or not, I truly believe that whether you fed your baby breast milk for one day, one month, or one year. Fed is best and what matters is that you're making sure that your baby is just being fed and being treated properly. So just know that I hope these things work out for you but if they don't end up working out and you, you don't get to feed your baby breast milk, that's okay. There's always the next baby or 
you know what at least you tried and that's what makes you amazing in the first place I wanted to wish you guys a happy national breastfeeding month and I hope you guys like this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up make sure you subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you can find out when my next video drops I hope you guys are doing well and you're staying safe and I'll see you in the next video bye guys